Hi there guys and welcome to another reaction video. For this video I'm going to be reacting to John Cena accepts Bray Wyatt's Firefly Funhouse invitation. So we have Cena in the ring. WWE announced it's going to be continuous with guests. I hear that Ron Cena is going to go live on it. This was a message that left all of us, WWE superstars, the WWE universe, asking, like, what's really going to happen? I myself have been challenged to a Firefly Funhouse match. I cannot get a single human being to tell me anything that a Firefly Funhouse match this is. Would never happen. I don't even think Bray Wyatt himself knows what a Firefly Funhouse match is. Am I actually supposed to be afraid of a guy who dresses up like the overfed sex child of Wiz Khalifa and the WB Frog? Please! Goldberg exposed that the Fiend has weakness at WrestleMania. I Here comes the intensity the from Cena. The Fiend made this challenge for WrestleMania. I was ready to step aside, invest in the future. But the Fiend made this challenge. And to make matters worse, he has tried to get himself every advantage. He has asked for his match on his turf, on his terms. Really good promo from seeing the hair. This is, this, is, this is really good. This is great. Bray Wyatt finds your ridiculous challenge at WrestleMania. I accept. And now, and now we're starting to see the uh, puppets along the side. Puppets along the side. Rabbit of the pig. Yeah, got all that there, and um, there's Abby the pig. So, yep. Yeah. Uh, all there. Cena's looking. Cena's looking a bit scared there. This has been done really well. Uh, the lights go out, typical fiend fashion. Usually playing some creepy music, and uh, the fiend's up there. And there's the stare down. <laughs> no, no, there's brain right behind him saying let me in and then he disappears um, by the way that was brain in human form saying um, let me in and then the lights went out again and brain white disappeared and John Cena was left in the ring on his own um, that was done that was done really well that was great so definitely the best exchange between the two so far, and it's the one right before WrestleMania. Uh, it, it's it's intriguing to see what they're going to do in this Firefly Funhouse match. You know, make it fun, make it good. Um, whether it's on the Saturday night, you know, in part one or part two on the Sunday, we'll just have to wait and see. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, then hit the like, subscribe, and don't forget to share. And I'll see you next time.